Hey, what up everybody, Nerdy Biker back again. I'm just out about Omaha trying to find some people to ride with. And uh, figured I'd talk about some nerdy stuff while I was doing so since I haven't made a video where I actually talked about nerdy stuff. It's just been me riding around with some of the guys watching them do wheelies and whatnot. So, we're going to talk about some Diablo 3 today. Uh, season 10 started not too long ago, a couple days ago I think, and uh, I've been playing it with a few of my friends, and been having a pretty good time. Uh, so if you want to play Diablo, I'll throw my battle down that down in the description. You can hit me up uh, if you play, and I'll even power level you if you need to up to 70 so that you can play with us. Right now the highest I've went is 75 on Greater Rifts uh, solo and I think to 79 or 80 uh, in group uh, as a duo, not not any more than two people. But I'm playing uh, Impale Demon Hunter right now, uh, having a lot of fun with it. I really like the Shadow Set Impale playstyle on Demon Hunters. Uh, I like the the jumping around like assassin kind of aspect to it. It's kind of cool. Uh, I started off playing Marauder Grenades and I just ran up to a wall due to my gear and I was getting a lot more shadow and pale stuff than I was Marauder Grenade stuff. So I switched over. Plus I kind of planned on playing in pale anyways um, just because I really like that playstyle and it got a buff. So if you didn't know it got buffed, instead of only throwing one dagger when you use Impale, you now throw three. And each of those three daggers can proc the 40,000 percent damage buff, which is pretty sweet. And the best part is if you hit the same target, with all three, if you're standing close enough and you hit the same target with all three, they all proc that extra damage. And that's kind of why it's uh, probably the top uh, solo demon hunter build right now, is because of that insane single target damage you can do. So for anybody that doesn't know, uh, the shadow demon hunter, what it basically does is every time you use impale, you can tumble for free. So you throw a dagger and then tumble and throw a dagger and tumble. And you can do this to ignore all of the trash mobs. So you just ignore all the peons and go straight for the elites and bosses and stuff like that. And then you kill those guys and you ignore all the peons and keep going. It's a lot of fun. Um, you're always bouncing around the map and it's a lot of fun to play. So then I've also been running duo with my buddy. He's playing uh, Leapquake Barbarian. Um, so between the two of us, um, he'll take care of a lot of the trash and I'll kill the elites and stuff. And that's kind of how we've been uh, accenting each other. And we've pushed up to 80. Uh, by doing so. It'd be really useful if we had another um, AoE DPS, like Lightning Wizard or a, a Firebats Witch Doctor. Be great. Um, that way we could kill the trash and get it out of the way a lot faster. Um, because that's kind of our biggest downfall is um, for me to kill the elites, uh, the trash has to be out of the way. And the Leap Quake does really good at pulling all the trash together but the damage isn't really high like that's just how it is so if we had another aoe dps it would be better now i think the plan is we want to try to to get 90 plus in groups um Theoretically, as the the Shadow and Pale Demon Hunter, I could go 90 plus, but I think that that would require a lot more gear and a lot more fine tuning. Um, so I'll probably be lucky to solo hit 80, just because I don't spend the time farming and grinding.
So if you're playing Diablo 3 or if you ever played Diablo 3, leave a comment down in the the comment section, you know, let me know what you like to play and what build you like and stuff like that. How far you've made it on greater rifts and stuff. Snowing down at Rick's Boatyard. I think I'll just stroll through downtown, maybe run up Dodge Ways. See if I run into anybody. If not, then I guess I'll just head home. Play some Diablo. <laughs> Alright nerds, so hung out with some other bikers, uh, with some freeway riding, so I didn't even upload it, because I know that's boring. But I hope you liked today's video, if you liked it, hit that like button, if you want to see more, hit subscribe, and until next time, see you nerds.